$78 for two bags. That ain't right. You know, unless I, yep, Dadgum it! I scanned the laundry detergent three times. They won't tell me that I did that, but they will stop me in my tracks if I forget to scan some bubble gum. Apparently I don't do a good job scanning Walmart. Well, I didn't ask to do it. This keeps up. I'm gonna have to see a different doctor. Go from Dr. Pepper to Dr. Thunder. I'll do it. I'm not happy about it, but I will do it. At least Natty Light costs the same, I think, actually. Yeah, I'm not really sure, but after eight of them, I don't even care anymore. Let me just tell you, it's hitting all of us pretty hard around here. I'll, I'll just say that the bathroom trash cans have not been lined with a Target bag in months. Yeah, we back to those gray Walmart bags. And what happened to those? They're so thin now. That's another rant for another time. Just when we needed them most. Six dollars for a whole box of Girl Scout cookies. I mean, what are they putting in those things? Now, actually don't tell me that because I did just eat the entire box of Tagalongs. I mean, I woofed them down. Didn't even get out of the parking lot. No, get this, I heard Tammy say that a whole tub of Country Crock cost her $6 yesterday. Yeah, but then she told me that she was gonna use it to make biscuits instead of butter. Honestly, they should have charged her more. Tammy, yeah, the same, that Tammy. Yeah, Tammy. And now we got shrinkflation, because I've been telling y'all that they've been making these Butterfinger bars smaller. I mean, look at that. It's definitely not because I'm getting bigger. Maybe. Everybody's trying to make the ends meet, except for Regina. You know why? One word, chickens. Yeah, she's got a whole operation going down there. She even got somebody dealing the eggs for her. It's like a redneck Heisenberg over there. Kathy said that she spent $12 on lunch yesterday at the Burger King. <laughs> Whew, man, I almost don't believe it. But I'll have to, because there ain't no way that I'm gonna eat at Burger King. I have standards. They're very low, but they do exist. If I wanted to eat out of a dumpster, I'd just go to Crystal's. I don't think we're gonna make it up to Gatlinburg this year. But I did just get some Crystal Light packets, and we're gonna put some rubbing alcohol in a mason jar and just do our own moonshine tasting. Probably tastes better. Oh, you're in the market for a new car? Okay, well, I, I recommend that you shop around a little bit. Definitely go to at least four different dealerships. Yeah, no, not for the best deal. Just go see what kind of furniture they have because you definitely gonna get bent over and you know who the real winners are in all of this. Yeah, the pawpaws. They were complaining about prices before it was cool. Now everybody's saying back in my day, I'm gonna give credit where credit's due, that's pawpaws line. But for real though, back in my day, everything was a lot cheaper. And by that, I mean last year. All my Republican friends are blaming the president. My Democrat friends are blaming greedy CEOs. And here I am, you know, can't afford duct tape to shut either one of them up. I had to cancel Netflix, but oh no, but not because of the price, because they killed Ruth at the end of Ozark. Yeah, oops. Spoiler alert, but I'm mad and I want him to know about it. Now, I wanted to go see George Strait on tour, but those tickets cost as much as my dang on mortgage payment. I guess King George's gotta offset that Arizona property he can't get rid of. I guess I'll wait till the next time he does a retirement tour. I mean, this is what, the third time? They're gonna be wheeling him out there. Have you seen the price of propane lately? I mean, yeah, no, no, yeah, no, me neither. We're charcoal all the way, for sure, yeah. <laughs>